All right, guys, we're back. It's day four in Vegas, you know. We were down about 3,000 from the first three days between, you know, expenses and gambling and everything. And, uh, you know, we're down, but we're not out. We're actually, we're gonna shake it out. All right, I've completely shaken it out. We, uh, we're gonna win today. We're going over to the Paris right now. We're actually a little late. We're gonna play the $600 PLO event. If you don't know what PLO is, it's Texas Hold'em with four cards. And uh, you have to use two of them. You can't just use one. So I don't really know how to play PLO that well, but I, clearly I don't know how to play Hold'em that well either. So we're just gonna go fire this event. And uh, we're only gonna fire one bullet. And if we lose it, we're gonna go play cash games for Texas Hold'em. We're gonna try to grind out a little bit of profit on the day. But to start out, we're gonna fire $600 in a bracelet event that we have no business being in. But at the end of the day, it's poke. I understand it a little bit. So we'll see what happens. Uh, today's sweatshirt, uh, Supreme Box logo. The, the, uh, the goal here is to intimidate people to think that I'm rich and not just a dumb idiot who won a $7,000 poker tournament in college and said, what's the dumbest thing I could possibly spend $1,000 on? The answer is a hooded sweatshirt. So we're going to wear this today, and uh, yeah, we're going to see what happens, and uh, I'll see you guys in the Paris. All right, I'm back in the Paris. I got 600 bucks. I'm about to enter this PLO event. The least you could do is like and subscribe. I'm burning thousands. Registration line's a little shorter than the No Limit events. Let's do it. All right, guys, I got my ticket for the $600 PLO. I don't really know how to play PLO, but we're probably going to win it. We're in the black section. We got the same stack as yesterday. Let's run it up. Quick update. Apparently, the last four hands at my table have all been an all-in, so I guess this is going to go pretty quick. Uh, PLO, you can flop the nuts and be way behind, so let's do it. I thought for sure that It's a bigger plus, too. Like, How much oh, is shit. it? Let's go, baby. First hand. First hand. PLO is an easy game. All right, we're on the first break of the PLO event. We started with thirty thousand. We now have eighty-three thousand. We were all in on our first hand. We obviously won it, and uh, yeah, we're running pretty good. A little backstory: I've only played PLO like two or three times in my life, but let's keep it running, and uh, it'll be a story for the final table. Let's do it. All right, we're riding back into battle. We just had the sickest croissant sandwich ever. I ate it so fast I couldn't film it. But we got 83,000, let's run it up to a million. Come on now. All right, we're getting moved to yellow. We have a little over 100,000 in our stack. We're playing well, let's do it. <laughs> and then you wasted the house on one. All right, guys, I'm on the third break. Uh, when I got moved tables, I had a little over 100,000, but some guy went all in for 17,000, and some other guy went all in on top of him for 35,000. Uh, I made the call with 8, 9, 10 jack, thinking I'd hit a straight, and I did hit a straight, but he hit a flush, so I lost that. I'm a little over 70 on this break. But I just got to get back and play great PLO, which I totally know how to do because I'm a PLO professional. So uh, chip in a chair, probably around average chip stack right now. So not bad. And uh, yeah, we're probably going to win this thing. Wasn't going to do any palate cleanses today, but I probably shouldn't be playing PLO either. So I'm going to go put $100 on the numbers. I haven't hit it yet in Vegas, so let's smash it. Once again, we bricked the numbers. We'll probably never hit it while we're in Vegas, but that palate cleanse just does something to me, baby. Let's run good in poker. Come on now, PLO champs. Diamond winner? Let's go. Triple up, fuck yeah. All right, we might be close to the bubble. They're making us go hand for hand. Dealers are waiting. We got Dean from Twitter, baby. Unreal that we're right next to him. We tweet at him all the time. Let's do it. Come on, let's make the money in this PLO tournament. We don't even play PLO. We're officially in the money. We locked up $962 for a $600 investment. We're about average in chips, so we're going to run it up a little bit before we bag, obviously, because we're going to win the tournament, obviously, because we're PLO pros. All right, we're on dinner break for the PLO event. We're pretty low on chips. The average is like 220000 We only have 90000 and we lost a pretty big pot at the end. But uh, we're already in the money. I think we're guaranteed at least $1,000 now for a $600 investment. Like I said, it's the first ever time I've played PLO in a tournament and probably only like the third or fourth time I've ever played PLO in my life. So we absolutely take it. You know, this is gonna be our second cash out of only three events. They only cash 15% uh, of every field. So to cash two out of three tournaments at 15% is an amazing clip. We might be getting buried in the pits and gambling, but what are you gonna do, you know? I'm gonna go grab some food and uh, yeah, I mean, we need at least two or three hands when we get back, but I'm sure we'll get them and I'm sure we'll win this bracelet. Let's do it. I love you. 
This is the clock at dinner break, 3,200 entrants, only 374 left. Little beef and broccoli, something slightly healthy for once. We're gonna eat like a champion, because we are a champion. Hoodie, Bretzky engaged, we're back in less than two minutes, let's win this thing. Five. I got kings and a deuce. We need clubs, or a king. That's a king. We need no ace. One more card, no ace. Let's go. Winner. We just lost a massive pot with aces, guys. We're absolutely crippled. This isn't good. All right, guys, we busted. We came in 237th out of 3,200 people in a game we don't even know how to play. So we obviously take that. We cashed out for $1,358, so we made 758 profit. Uh, I love you guys. I'm going to head back to the hotel. A little disappointed when you run deep and you lose, but overall very happy with the result. Can't not be. So I love you guys. I'll see you back at the hotel. Before we walk out, I'll go put 100 on the numbers. I mean, it's got to hit eventually. Time for the reveal. It did hit eventually. 700 more on top of it. All right, guys, today was a great day. We cashed the PLO tournament for a $758 profit. All in all, we made $500 in the numbers. So we made a little over $1,250 today. Uh, it was a great day. I'm still a little glum. It always sucks to run super deep in a tournament. You know, when you bust, you're like, damn, that really sucked. I was so close. But I've never played a PLO tournament before, and it was like the third or fourth time playing. I know I sound like a broken record, but I really don't understand the game like I thought I did. But... You know, we played great for, you know, how we could, and uh, I love you guys. Today was our first green day, so, you know, that's really good. And, uh, yeah, I mean, we'll be back tomorrow. I'm not sure what tournament I'm playing. I might play the $1,500 six max, or I might go to a different casino because uh, the tournaments are starting to thin out, and I don't think I'm going to play the $300 tournament at the World Series because it's going to be like 30,000 people. So I love you guys, and uh, right now I got a preju sandwich and uh, some fried mushrooms for a little late night snicky snack after a win. So uh, I love you guys. I'm going to get some sleep and uh, I'll see you tomorrow.